My name is Roland Schmidt, and I'm here to talk to you about the J-Term project. Our seniors have the J-Term internship. Internship is an opportunity we extend to our seniors. About half of them take the opportunity, and it's a project where they, starting in the fall, take advantage of a business or a career possibility that they're interested in, and they talk to a local employer and ask them if they can have this opportunity in January to spend about three, work, uh, three weeks with them and try out a potential future career. It's not a job shadow program, and we've in integrated kids into all kinds of different opportunities, all the way from uh, a physical therapist to uh, veterinary, all the way into someone who wanted to be a mortician. So we've had a wide variety of people choose things, and they have to log 60 hours with their uh, business that they're working with. And kids are going to go ahead and they're going to work in these different fields, but we've asked that they integrate the kids as much as they possibly can. So it's not just a observation piece, it's also there's a very big production piece to this. And I'll follow up and I'll visit and I'll travel around and visit the kids and see them in their situation. And the kids, every time they work and spend an hour, whether it's an hour or five hours, within 24 hours we ask that they log in and tell us about their experience, what they've learned, what they have questions about, while at the same time being an active participant. So there is a large production piece. And what we have found is the kids bring a lot of skills that they have already that businesses can find interesting. Many kids last year had technology skills that businesses took advantage of. And we had, for example, a person who worked at the uh, uh, funeral home studying to be a possible mortician and seeing how that field carried out. Um, they wanted to be on the web. They wanted to uh, see uh, what can we do to have a presence on Facebook. And this student was really able to be a very active participant about setting that up and making that happen and also for online merchandising, doing a lot of research. So many of these businesses, some things they wanted to get done and uh, possibly see within their field but just didn't have that time, these students were able to step in and, and gain some valuable insights about how this business worked. But at the same time, they also were able to, to uh, be involved in a production piece and offer something back to that was valuable for the business end as well. Uh, all of this 60 hours, and again, this constant uh, interaction between myself and the kids, and then they would log. We would create a uh, an online website where the kids can go and log and then would interact with me, asking them questions and posing them. And what most of the kids found was that the vast majority of them said, boy, they were really, really excited about what they did and that this is something I just am so happy I've had the opportunity to do. I want to pursue this, Mr. Schmidt. I want to, I want to do this. I want to go to college. I want to come back and, and maybe even work in our town that way. Uh, there were a couple who said, you know, this has been valuable in a very different way. I found out that this is not something that I want to do. Uh, this is a lot different than I thought it would be. So even in that capacity, that was valuable for our kids. And so, and again, about half of our seniors took advantage of this, and almost all of them said it was such a valuable piece of information for them to experience this, and then to be able to come back and say, this is something that I do want to pursue, or, or not. So the internship program proved to be a very valuable opportunity for our kids, and who wouldn't want, who of us would not have wanted an opportunity when we were a senior in high school to say, can I, can I give a test run to this career that I'm thinking about. Who of us would not have wanted that opportunity? So what started out as an idea turned out to be a very successful one and a very popular idea for our kids here at Spirit Lake High School.